Hello, YouTube. Rick Farrett checking in from Briarville, the repair and restoration shop at Joe Case Pipes. And today we're sitting over in the shipping and receiving department. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about how we get our pipes, the repaired pipes and refurbished pipes, back to the clients, back to you guys. And uh, but before we get into the uh, in, into that portion of it, uh, let me uh, let me show you this little uh, 1960 uh, era golden uh, brevia. This is a uh, uh, this is a really nice pipe. I've had it for years and years, probably going on 20 now. And uh, I occasionally pull it out just when I want to smoke a uh, just have a classic uh, relaxing smoke. Uh, this pipe is in excellent condition, and I, I just love it. And I don't keep it here in the shop because it's <laughs> not one of those kind of pipes. Uh, having a cup of coffee with my uh, Sutliff mug because I'm smoking some Sutliff 1849. Uh, Pipe tobacco out of their uh, their new tin, and it's uh, that 1849 is pretty good as well. It's a Virginia uh, and Perique blend, so if you like that spiciness, I would uh, I'd recommend that. The 1849 is uh, pretty much uh, when my partner Joe Case was born, so he probably saw this uh, being made. He's the old guy. You know. He's going to love that. I stole that joke, too. Joe's doing pretty good, though. He's got all moved into his uh, into his shop. It's a gorgeous shop. Check out his videos at uh, JoeCasePipes.com and on his uh, YouTube channel. But the uh, pipes are coming out now just absolutely gorgeous as normal. And, uh, and that, that, that shop is, uh, well... Covet thy brother-in-law's shop. What can I say? Yeah. <laughs> He's just got a lot of room, and it's set up very well. Anyway, back to this shop and our shipping and the receiving department. Uh, reason for this video is uh, I've been getting a lot of emails back from uh, uh, clients saying uh, just blown away by the way their pipes uh, arrive back to them. They just really like the way we uh, ship out uh, ship out our pipes. And uh, so I wanted to show you guys uh, uh, what we're doing here because you know what? Our pipes are absolutely personal effects. They're uh, are, it's a big part of our our uh, uh, our life. Uh, we just love them. I mean, there's no doubt about it. So we take the best care of them that we can. And when your motto is pipe repair as close as your mailbox, we've got to make sure that's done right. And and. Knock on wood in almost a year and a half here, and uh, I'm going to knock on knock real hard on that. That uh, we have, we've had no issues with the mail, and quite frankly, with the vast improvements with the uh, uh, USP uh, uh, United States Post Office and and their packing uh, uh, or their packages, uh, then the uh, the tracking that they're now doing. Uh, the, this could not have been done 10 years ago the way we're doing things now and obviously the trend in the in the business where one would take their broken pipe to their friendly neighborhood brick and mortar to be sent off to to me or someone else just isn't happening uh, like it used to uh, people are taking control of their own uh, destiny so to speak and uh, uh, the internet uh, is is providing a wealth of information on how to get this stuff done, and quite frankly, the brick and mortars really don't want to mess with it. Uh, 
as, as much as they used to. So uh, our model here at Briarville, obviously, is to work individually with you, and um, that way you've got total control on the uh, uh, on the whole process, and you're you're kept informed from from everything. Part of that, obviously, is getting your pipes back. And so let's uh, let's check out a couple things over here. Do a, a box opening, so to speak. This is one of our boxes that we're using, and it's uh, these are kind of a prototype that I got uh, from a friend of mine who works in IT. He. Uh, uh, provides, uh, he repairs computers, installs memory and whatnot in, for major corporations and he gets a ton of these boxes uh, or had a ton of these boxes which uh, bless his heart he thought about me and what I'm doing over here and, uh, and gave them to me. Uh, incidentally when these run out I've already found a, uh, a replacement uh, uh, supplier to get the same thing and then obviously we'll replace you know this with with our own but the uh, the practice is is here to continue but so let's open up this box and 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 this box is intended to be reused so when you get our box back with your pipe you know don't throw it out because your next pipe that needs to be shipped out uh, uh, will be uh, just fine using this again. But it's a, st it's a very sturdy 200 pound uh, weight uh, uh, cardboard. Uh, when you open it, it is, when you open it, it's, it's covered with uh, foam rubber. Inside your pipe will be in a, uh, uh, wrapped in a uh, tissue paper. And let's unwrap this just for right now. So I did want to show you this. This is our, our, our latest stunt pipe that we're using for marketing. Um, and it's a, uh, a Wally Frank era uh, um, Costello uh, that uh, we replaced the stem on. And I even got the old stem. The old stem was broken, chewed through, and uh, as you can tell, and it had a uh, little uh, rhinestone adornment, and that's that's the distinction between the Wally Frank, the late Wally Frank Costello when he distributed these, and the Costellos that are coming out now that have just the uh, the white acrylic inlay across the top. So that indicates that this is an older one. So we went ahead and uh, uh, re-adorned the new stem with a uh, with a uh, rhinestone. This is my personal pipe. I wanted the stem a little longer, so I went ahead and made it a little longer. So it's not. Uh, I mean, it's it's not pristine. But this is this is my pipe, and that's the way I wanted to smoke it. So I went ahead and added a longer one. But you can see. That the, uh, the the pipe the, is a is an absolutely beautiful pipe, and that stem came out great, and uh, uh, it's now our uh, our current stunt pipe that we're using in marketing. This is the one we were showing off at the show. So anyway, back to the box. The uh, uh, your pipe is encased in uh, foam rubber. In, in that uh, packing, it, it, they'll fit, you know, three or four pipes in here, and it all fits together. And uh, uh, buttons up quite securely. We also use the uh, we also use all printed uh, printed labels to avoid any type of uh, any type of confusion or anybody not being able to read bad handwriting and the labels obviously just uh, peel off and a little struggle this morning <laughs> 
Let me just peel off and uh, affix across there like so. Very address is very clear. No confusion. Tracking very clear. No confusion. We're uh, we're a hundred percent with these. Now, obviously, when uh, we when we run out of these gifted boxes that. Uh, that the uh, company received, we'll, we're going to replace them with our own, and uh, you won't have the uh, you won't have the uh, the old uh, label on it. It'll be it'll be one of our own. But that's just uh, just one of the ways that uh, we're making sure that your cherished possessions in those pipes are uh, are getting back to you in uh, intact and in the fashion that you expect and require. So well, that's it. Let me see what else, anything else. Just kind of a look at what's going on on the table here. Uh, pipes, when they're done, obviously they get wrapped. Now, this is our kind of <laughs> the gloves we use for the last little uh, buff up, you know, before they get put into the box. They're uh, get any last fingerprint off it, uh, off your pipe, and then before they're wrapped. And then uh, they're packaged up. Uh, post office comes and gets them, and that is why this is pipe repair as close as your mailbox. But anyway, I appreciate you guys, and it's been uh, been great over here. Uh, keep the work coming. I totally uh, uh, love that. And um, thanks so much. And thanks for watching. Uh, can't think of anything else unless you guys got something. I'll wait. <laughs> I'm out. Peace out. This is Rick with Briarville, the repair and restoration shop at Joe Case Pipe saying, see ya.